Uh, my name is Jacob, and I'm ready for my second fight. Hopefully, I end up 2 0 in the yard. Be a fun day. Y'all remember this kid from his war with Turk? No quit in him. Be safe, fellas. Fight hard. Fighters come in. Now, the guy on the left looks relatively harmless. He looks that way, he's skinny, he's lanky, his opponent is taller, more shredded. This doesn't look like a good matchup on surface level, but a knowledge advantage goes a long way when it comes to martial arts. He goes for the double leg, picks him up, and from there, he drops him. Drops his man, takes his back, gets his hooks in, he's under the chin, gets a body triangle, and from there, it's a waiting game. His opponent is in deep waters. What's he going to do? Never underestimate any man who trains, even a smaller man. Because when it comes to the knowledge advantage, taking advantage of the details that another person may not understand, it's a game that turns into child's play. It's like you're fighting a child when they don't know what they're doing, when they're swimming in waters they don't understand, when they're in too deep. Quite frankly, there is very little resistance. Knowledge advantage. The guy looks harmless. He ends up winning. It's too easy. You got your wish. 2-0 in the yard. Street beefs.